Today we're gonna do a little bit of a G-Speed V4 versus Power Hobby 10-2 chassis. This is my G-Speed V4. It has a Holmes Hobbies 2700 KV Polar Pro Stubby, TGH forward motor mount. Uh, I think that's the OG transfer case. Uses Vanquish F10 Phoenix portal axles. Uh, SAD shocks. Micro, Mama Micro X2 it has no brass in it, other than the you know the little, comes with little pieces in the axles, but that's it. Don't, it doesn't have anything extra added to it. it has the SHV 650 Holmes Hobby Servo. This is the Power Hobby chassis. It's uh, you take everything off your 10-2, put it right on this chassis. You'll have to buy two drive shafts. On mine, I've got the Deluxe Fab cut to fit seven inch drive shaft I think and then up front I've got a little stubby Vitavon drive shaft it uses a home hobby uh, Trailmaster Pro 2700 kV motor has a cheap 35 kg Amazon servo uh, but this is really like the first time I've had it out since I've fixed it and rebuilt it of course I put servo on axle of course, I guess you have to with this kit. I'm not exactly 100% sure if you can get around that or not. But let's see how they compare today. Here we're going to do a simple tire, uh, turn test. Back tires, touching the thing. Back tire, even with the edge of the 6x6 or 4x4. 6x6, I guess. Full turn. See where we end up. Just going to cross slow. Let the truck do its own thing. I think the power hobby is actually going to beat it, but I don't know. All right, we've ended up right there. Let me get a rock or something. We'll give it right there, because you can turn the tire in. Well, let's we'll slide it over just a little bit. I'd say that's fair. All right, let's get the power hobby. All right, we've got the power hobby set up. Back as far as it'll go, tire even with the end of the 6x6. Full turn, let's let it go. This truck should turn sharper than the V4 because this has overdrive in it. But I don't think it's gonna happen. I think my I think the V4 is gonna beat it. All oh, by a country mile looks like. Oh Lord, not even close. Yeah, not even close. That's terrible. Especially for a 10-2. 10-2s usually turn awesome. To start things off with, we're just going to see how they get up on this rock and then come over to this, see if we can get up on this rock the camera's set up on. We've got a little tripod, so maybe that might help. This truck also has gold bit of on wheels on it too. I actually originally bought these for my Element Ecto. I guess you can't see anything there, can you? get that all right let's see what the v4 can do
got that part of it. Let's see about this part of it. I can get the camera set just right. I assume it's going to get this part a little bit easier. Oh yeah, walked right up that. Shoot, yeah. Here's another little line I, just to try. Didn't have my drag brake turned on. There we are. Try it one more time. Of course, I know if I give it a bump, it'd go right up. It'd just... Sometimes I guess that's what it takes. Let's see what the old Power Hobby FS has. And of course, I'm not as, this is one, one of the, only the second or third time I've ever driven this truck, so I'm not that familiar with it. It's going to take a little bit of, let's learn how to drive it. You got it, though. Here's another line that I've done a handful of times with my... V3. I, I can't remember if I had my V4 on this rock or not. Generally, this is one that I've had to bump up on before. Just like that little bit. And then it's all about the tires just getting the right hook. I also don't know, I might have failed to mention, both of these are running 4S too. Let's see how easily or not easily the V4 gets up on it. Whoa. Of course, I think that I had the back of the, had the back of the truck just right for that, maybe. But done a killer job here's another pretty good little line of course the forward skid on this truck makes it get up over stuff like that really easy I've got my G-Speed FS to start on next. Just waiting on some parts to become available. Let's we'll see what the V4 can do.
course this truck sits up high enough it doesn't even care about that right there oh 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 Power Hobby definitely seemed more planted that first time around, that's for sure. Just have to give it a little bit of a go, yeah. Nice. 